So we went to the Ryanair desk, of which we stood in a queue for six hours. Um, people were crying, panicking. Um, my sister back in England was trying to get us flights back home. There was nothing available with Ryanair at all. Um, so our only option was to get a flight back with Jet2, uh, yeah, Jet2 Holidays, of which we had to fund ourselves. Um, we were given two bottles of water and a voucher for £3.50, which anybody knows in the airport you cannot get a lot for £3.50. So after waiting six hours in the queue, um, my sister got, got to the queue um, and said, like, you know, what do we do? Well, we'll, we'll give her a hotel for the night. So six and a half hours later, they give us a hotel for the, for the evening, of which we were told a taxi would be picking us up to take us back to the airport, which never turned up. So we then had to fund, you know, we had to get our own money to get a taxi back to the airport to get our flight the following evening with Jet2. Uh, but we were given no information about what was going on, um, how, well, it was given nothing really, was we? No, there the, was the only flight we could get was to Birmingham as well. Yeah, so we had to then fund our own ways back from Birmingham to Newcastle, um, which was a bit of a trek. So yeah, it, it's cost us a lot of money to, to, um, to get home. We couldn't afford a hotel for another week, no way.